the, with the, T, T, booties, V94.9 WATV with V stands for variety on the home of the DD in the morning show. Isis Jones with you and it's time for foodies with the T. Hey, hello. Oh yeah, girlfriend, please. I've already had a wild day today. You've got to give me some good news, girlfriend. What's going on with Will Smith and Martin Lawrence? Well, hopefully this will pep you up a little bit. They have announced that they are really, they're working on Bad Boys 4. However, they don't know the name of it. Like, they're in the debate about the name. Since the last one was for life, we don't know what this one is going to be called. So, I'm excited, though, because I love the Bad Boys uh, franchise, the little movies. Everything is, I like it. So, I'm ready. I'm ready to I'm, see I'm it. I'm glad that, that Will is back, you know, in, in full acting mode. Um, I didn't get to see uh, the movie that he premiered with after, of course, the slap with Chris Rock. Mm -hmm. um, but I'm glad and I'm happy. And I'm, and I'm praying also this year that Will and Chris will get to have that talk, um, hopefully at some point in time. Yeah, um, they need to. Girl, because I, I still feel a little awkward. You know how you feel like it's like awkward, a little, you know, yeah. little, little, little commotion, little elephant in the room. But we'll we'll get to that before the end, year the end. I'm go ahead and predict that right now. Um, yes. but something I wasn't quite ready for, uh, but could be a good thing. You can tell me yes or no. We got uh <laughs> real live inmates out on the street. Yes. So today actually the state of Alabama has released 369. Uh, inmates under the law that was amended for 2015. So in the mass release, um, a lot of the inmates were actually on early release. They're doing an early release, I'm sorry, because they were scheduled to be released later this year or the uh, very first part of next year. So it was 369 people. Most of those did come from Jefferson County. Mm. So just be on the lookout. Um, everything, it, it ranges from marijuana, possession, theft, robbery, um, all the way up to murder, as well as some um, sexual offenders. So just, you can get the list on AL.com. Go look at the list just to make sure that, you know, you're going to be safe in your area, um, just to see who's being released. Um, but they had to do it. So here it is. I mean, and again, I'm I'm all for releasing people, in, you know, with certain charges. You know, I thoroughly mm -hmm. think that no one should be unlawfully um, detained in any form, fashion, shape, or way. But I do want people to be mindful because sometimes, you know, that time away can can breed certain um, attributes. But we're just gonna pray and hope that everybody stays safe out there, and including the uh, women and men who are coming off of this situation as well. We wish y'all luck too. But yeah. that's it, girlfriend. I mean, short of getting the list from you. You know, how we catch up with foodies with the TV, <laughs> sure that, uh, you know, we know of the name of the next Martin Lawrence. Right. So I'm actually going to post it on the foodies with the T page as well. <laughs> so you guys can get to that list a little quicker. Okay. But you can find us on foodieswiththetea.com. And it will list all of our social medias there as well. So make sure you go and follow us so you can keep up with the foodies. I know that's right. And you can catch up with them tomorrow because I'm airing out about the medical system tomorrow for Wellness Wednesday. And unfortunately, the toy got to hear all that tomorrow. So y'all got to hear it too. From 7 till 10, we got you, Foodies with the T, right here on Room 14 Twitter on V94.9. Be safe out there. Go look at the list, honey. <laughs> Quick.